Hey guys, Dr. Prometheus here. Welcome back. This is going to be a channel update. Everything that's going on from here. And uh, yeah, let's get uh, right into this because I have, to, oh, I have to do one more edit. Hold on. Okay, so we are going to get into this. And this is your March update. Uh, it's not going to be all of March, um, but it'll be mostly what March is because at the end of March, I'm going to be down in Florida. So the remaining part of March won't be finished and we'll be back first week of April. So without further ado, let's get right into this. Um, I'm, I'm sure I have, let's just use the FM, use the FM one. It works. So we're going to be doing this month. So we're rounding out. It's the 29th right now. So from here, uh, we're still going to have some streams, uh, Actually, right after this, I'm gonna put everything else on on YouTube. That's that's on the top line here for Thursday. I'm gonna eat and I'm gonna start streaming some Final Fantasy 7 at Rebirth. We'll probably take some days to get through that, but we're we're gonna have fun this weekend, just powering through and having fun and seeing everything that we can do in Final Fantasy 7. From there, I have the next episode of Haas out for tomorrow. And I have everything up to date to this point. Tomorrow's stream will have some F1 because at that point uh, I'm all caught up on the channel. And then from there, we'll have like three episodes of Haas on there when we uh, stream some F1. So eventually when we get caught up, we'll be fine there. And then Starfield, I'll have that all the way up until Saturday and then on the channel itself. Then we'll start having the Final Fantasy VII Rebirth and we'll put all that out an hour or so chunks and we'll uh i kind of try to label them like i do the starfield ones to tell you kind of what's exploration main story that sort of thing so we'll get through that and then we'll continue starfield after that uh for stream there uh broken arrow beta the beta is not going on right now so this is all stuff that has been recorded during the beta so i recorded 26 matches that I was happy with of putting in there and my OCD is going crazy. So I have to change that is I mean, we I played a lot of broken arrow instead of streaming. I literally just play broken arrow for five six hours a day trying to get enough videos to kind of last until mid-march until I can kind of go on vacation the last week or so of March. I also have a couple of Warno videos in there that are going to be tailored towards the end of March with some of the new like housekeeping stuff in there that I played with Joe and I think Pete. And so those will be a couple, uh, one being NATO, uh, NATO match and then a three V three and then, uh, with, uh, Soviets in here with T eighties from here. Uh, muscle playing Terminator Dark Fate Defiance. I'm loving it. It is I mean while the campaign is decently short It doesn't feel that way just because of the sole fact that we're playing on the hardest difficulty And yes save scumming because we don't really have a choice if we want to have Like the hardest difficulty I've played it on the easier difficulty Wise and was just kind of running through it where your random soldier would would have issues. So there's uh, like hundred percent damage for realism that's kind of like the sweet spot, but the trade-off is we have to save scum uh, because if you use a lot of units, just like it is in Gates of Hell, you will completely screw the campaign. So that's why we've done that. Last train home, working through it. I'm liking it so far. I think chapter six, we've kind of have four or five episodes into chapter six, or really just three. Uh, these... Three episodes are just chapter six and we're not even through it. So there's probably going to be five to six just for chapter six itself before we actually get into Siberia, I'm guessing. Or chapter seven. So same thing with uh, Football Manager. Uh, still pumping this out. We're going to have some fun. We're going through at Southport. So uh, yeah, I'm having fun with that. I feel like we're on the cusp of getting some good stuff going. Um, so for... The portion when I actually leave now, I'm likely leaving on the 20th. So we'll do something like this. If we're not done with Final Fantasy, it'll be here. Otherwise, we'll have like an F1 stream 
it'll be monday tuesday it'll be in there wednesday will be when i'm out we will still have stuff on the channel just the streams won't be going because i won't be at my pc from there and we should have enough last train home and terminator dark fate to kind of work through uh that portion so that's what i'm kind of kind of, kind of pound through uh, depending on if we get through this what i might end up doing is there is a patch at some point in march now i don't know when this patch is or when this dlc is and that is the new dlc for uh victoria 3. it doesn't have a date yet we will play a victoria 3 playthrough i don't know who i'm going to play as because this one is more tailored towards like subjects and power alliances and things like that Plus, I never really messed with the uh, colonization mechanics in Africa or anything for that whole thing. So I'm thinking we do Portugal, maybe Netherlands kind of has the, the big colony in Asia wise. So yeah, maybe Portugal in that and we eventually try to take over iberia and spain with that depending on what happens i think that would be a good one because it's just a straight colonization maybe also since there is uh portugal there maybe we try to also take on uh, brazil and try to get the uh, south american sphere of influence back that could be a good uh, fun campaign to kind of play with that so that's what i'm thinking and then i'm going to play because a ck3 uh, last DLC I didn't play the tournaments one We also have another one coming out on the fourth I'm gonna be playing that and we are gonna do a count Zymut of Plock in Poland So this has uh, some significance because some of my family is actually from this area back uh, back during like 1700 time frame. So I thought hey, let's play something that I've just out of the comfort zone something that relates and something that we can tour around and have some fun with it but also have some type of border uh, so we can expand type deal so we're gonna play as this count in poland and we're gonna have some fun we're gonna see what we can do if we can get the kingdom of poland maybe we can even exert an alliance on the holy roman empire and just try to assert ourselves as the emperor and see how that goes so that is the gist. Now, there's a couple other things random that might be on the channel. One of them being Helldivers 2. I want to get into it and play with some of the guys in the, the squad's Discord, but there's just so much stuff going on. So I want to get into that with Final Fantasy. I mean, we have to play that right. It, it's Final Fantasy from that. Um, some of the other ones, Dragon's Dogma comes out while I'm in Florida. So likely that will be probably delayed until April. And so we'll push all of this back. Homeworld 3 was delayed until May by the devs. So that's not there. And so the idea with that will probably be Final Fantasy 7 through March. Maybe we'll hop into Dragon, uh, Dragon's Dogma 2 with that. I'm not sure if I'd like the game. So I'll probably have to watch some gameplay to see. That might be subject to change. Otherwise, we might eventually get into the Spider-Man series. Probably like months later. But we do have the Cyberpunk DLC, so... in Cyberpunk in general, because I haven't played through it. And there's a lot of games that don't have release dates for this year or this quarter. Uh, one of them being the new King Arthur, Ninth Legions, or whatever it is. Legion 9 or... It's another King Arthur uh, Knight's Tale type game that I definitely want to play because it uh, it looks pretty cool since it deals with Picts, Romans, kind of the same idea. And it looks really, really cool with that. That's supposed to be somewhere in the first quarter. I don't know. Yeah. Well, we're going to play it by ear, but... Oh, and then Millennia. Millennia comes out... Technically on the 26th I will be in Florida likely until the third meaning Millennia will likely be 
on the fourth. Now I'll probably get back the third, and there's a squad op. Uh, that that is typically the April Fools uh, squad operation on Wednesday. So I probably won't stream for this, and I'll probably get that. But Millennia comes out. I'm I'm excited. I really had fun with Millennia. So we are definitely going to hop in and play a lot of Millennia games. So that's your channel update. Nothing crazy, nothing insane. Um, just plugging away. And I really want to eat and get some uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And so thanks for hanging out. And I will see you guys next month in the next channel update to kind of sign this off. I really appreciate the support. We're at... Uh, 19 22 and subs in the last couple months have been 50 to 75 so it's been absolutely insane with all the support from broken arrow everything has been on the channel so thank you for that and uh yeah i'm gonna sign off now because i'll just start rambling so i will see you guys in one of the many videos on the channel later guys